I'll show you the easiest Twitter how to make the social media type poster in Photoshop today. Yes, I'm welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I give you the tutorial which is really cool and easiest way how to make the social media poster and this one is a trendy way and you can make more you know, like uh, uh, money or you can sell it or you can make it as a template in and you can sell this one into the marketplace so let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first here i'll go to in a photoshop and then go to the file and taking new options from here i'll take the artboard which is the 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel and giving the name sm for the social media and here is the resolution 200 dpi and hit the create button that's good and now going to the solid options and take the color which is a little bit of aqua blue type that means like this and hit ok that's good and going to the now gradient options from here i'll change into the style which is the radial and i'll change the color into the white or you can do another thing you can make this one like uh, that white and then going to the gradient options and now you can make this one radial style and you can just move like that and the scale should be 200 that's good and you can make this one like that and you can make this one zero that's cool and hit the ok button and you can change it change it up and you can make this one a little bit of darker that's good here i'll import the particles which is the man and the floating land over there so going to the file and going to the place embedded options here i downloaded this one from the png and like that the gradient should be underneath of this or you can make or drag this one into the upper side press ctrl or command t make this one a little bit of smaller like this and after that shadow portion so take the shadow upper side of this layer that means the gradient layer so make this one change into the black or you can press the d for the reset this one or x for the shift over there that's good going to the brush and take the soft brush and then you can work with that before that you have to take a blank layer by pressing here the plus sign and then going to the brush and select once you'll get the black color press ctrl or command t for the transformation and make this one stretch like that by pressing shift and hold it and place over there that's good now you can make the fill a little bit of like that and you can make the position proper into that that's good okay now i'll place the man over there going to the file and going to the place embedded options the man i this one is png as well and sit over there okay that's fine in this portion you are getting the shadow over there i have a small trick to make the shadow remove before that you have to make selection by using the subject selection tool so going to the subject selection select once over there the man the subject will select automatically which is the ai improvement of adobe and after selecting that you are getting over there the selection in this portion so the man only selected and press ctrl command j okay that's good so here only the man without the shadow so now shadow should be into the multiply so you are getting the shadow underneath of this and here the layer and the man okay that's good selecting these two things press ctrl command t right press and flip horizontal so i made this one horizontally flipped because of i want to make this text or make text over there so this three or shadow making this one group giving the man okay that's good and press ctrl or command a making this one middle of the artboard that's good okay that's fine now press ctrl or command d for deselect now time to write down over there so i written over there a cursive letter and uh, first of all logo and the bold letter 
so cursive letter and everything so cursive letter i took here the marketing agency and lorem ipsum so copying this one and control command v over there control command t over there i'll provide you the text in my video description please check out my text in my video description so just making over there that's good or you can make this one a little bit up down that's good and this land should be like that yeah that's fine and now the next text that is the boot camp and the training and the basic options so copying this one and before that you have to make this one group so title the ITL title that's good and making this one group okay that's fine control command v this text again i used over there the the cursive letter the formal letter and the formal letter over there but this one the training session or a basic to advance i made here the 800 uh, gap between two letters and the font that is uh, 3.9 and the font i'll provide you in my video description so i'm using here the cursive font which is the uh, personal use breathing 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 okay that's good and here i use the formal font which is the uh, poppins type font here agency this one this one is the poppins bold and over there that's good and here the sign up and this one that's really easy so here the button so button this one is a button here i took a shape from here so from the rectangle tool i'll take the shape like that and the shape color should be according to this agency color so you can pick up the color by pressing here double press over there and take the color like that okay that's fine and the font should be same like that or uh, press control or command j so press control or command j and press control or command t and make this one white and taking this one upper side making the color into the white and sign up today so s i g n up okay that's good and in this case i should make this one into the normal font or like medium type font that's good so sign up this one is a circular and you can make the circular uh, the round of the corner by using over there so here a little bit so i'm using here 15 pixel that's good for this okay that's fine and here i used uh, icon which is the call icon here in this portion call icon here i downloaded this one from the flat icon and the booking and the like uh, book appointment and the phone number copying this one and making this one paste over there press control command t making this one into this place that's good so making this one zoom and make this one proper alignment into this that's good and making this one group actually control command g press enter control command g and make this one upper side of this the sign up and the basic uh, sign up button and everything so sign up and button should be like a different like a button b u double t double t and button and here this one that is the call call button that's good the basic this that is the subject that's good so here the title and everything man so title subject button and call that's good now i'll add the logo over there going to the place embedded options and i'll find out my logo this logo okay making this one smaller and placing over there okay. that's good press enter that's good and making this one into the group and for the making this one into the middle of the artwork now i'll make this one like ungroup layers that's good now the uh, like particles like this type of particles those are png 
so going to the file and going to the place embedded options so png is easiest way to make this one so right press and flip horizontal and now flip vertical okay that's fine and making those things into over there that's good and now we can change the blending mode like this so you are getting the uh, blend over there and you can down opacity if you want and your design is ready and now going to the control or command control or command shift s and change the uh, mode which is the jpeg mode and save this one into your directory and done so one thing is that if you want to change the color options you can double press over there and you can change up all the colors which one is favorite for you or which one is suitable for your uh, company color code you can use or you can make this one darker or lighter if you want and you can change up the scenario so you can make these these a uh, little bit of bluish like that which is really cool so you have that option to change it out which is really nice and it will give you the assumption or you can give you the option to change it out so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of questions query requests please do comment on my video comment section and in the next video is i'm signing up today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers and bye bye